Prepare to okay, fight. Okay, grand final. Go. Round begins in. Let's uh, Three, who should we, we start on Maxter maybe? Yeah, I'm one. Like, sorry, dude. Fight. Yeah. Stupid portals. Give me the damn stupid places with damn stupid monsters. Okay, interesting move. It does uh, get a lot of time pass. Yeah, wow, crazy. <laughs> Having the better weapons to fight with. The Maxter's LG did not enough to uh, fend them off. Crazy on that quick champion, very hard to hit, and just slides around the corner, gets another rail frag on Maxter. And uh, Maxter in for a hard start of this map. So far, yeah, trying to orb for some bait, but Crazy doesn't buy it, and he gets his third frag, and he's still you know, pretty strong when it comes to this deck. He doesn't lose out on much, it's not a costly engagement for him. Another frag, maybe? Misses okay. the last frame. The aggressive start from Razy just uh Maxter there's so much pressure on him. This is the first time he gets a bit unscathed out of the fight while also doing some to Razy, but uh Wow. Razy still walks away as Victor in the next game. Maxter too early on this mega help. But yeah, you, you need to do something, right? It starts with, with a major item, but hmm, not the getting mega it. Was up. Yeah. But the mecha was up, but Maxter was he was purposely not trying to take it for some reason. Maybe I think maybe he was trying to create a gap between the items or something, but he didn't. He was spotted by Razi and he couldn't really go out into the open again so yeah yeah that that was mainly the reason that he didn't go for the mega health because uh, yeah so he was uh, split between the rock and a hard place yep so yeah further strengthening this uh, wave of control coming in for racing right now it just he's well yeah he's been so far it's been old racy in this game Maxter hasn't had a chance so far. You know, Racy, he's been on a fairly long break. Probably feeling really refreshed. Uh, and uh, he's got a lot of fun up his sleeve so far. 6 0 now. Still, early days. Not even 3 minutes have passed. Still a chance for Maxter. If he can find a frag here, he can start rolling. He even looks revitalized, right? Like he had a long pause, but uh, he just uh, goes. Hey, he switched on. That was and so rad. I do think like the first two free frags, like Maxer just got completely bamboozled by the aggressiveness of Razy, and now it's spiraling out of control. Yeah, Racy's not playing around. He's uh, he wants to get this over with quick. He wants to go straight to a 2-0 advantage here uh, in this best of five here. Not sure how much money that's on the line, but it's uh, it's money. But you know, it's it's the pride that matters. But 9-0, Maxter, you need to find a frag right now. You need to start rolling. You need to find something. Uh, otherwise, this is over before it started almost and uh race doesn't have any armor right now this is a good opportunity for maxter to go in because race is on a light champion you know uh, easy to take away some of some of that health but well he does pick up heavy and i believe that he still has to inject no he doesn't his inject is not up for another 20 seconds so maxter has an opportunity right here But first, there's an opportunity, and then there is. Well, this might be it. Oh, Racy. Circling around. And uh, yeah, there is no kill shot for the Maxter. Well, the tribal might be an entry, but yeah, it's still Racy has the upper position. Now drops below and Maxer gets the angle. And now Maxter's on the board, finally. The question is, can he keep this up? Uh, 
So it picks up Mega, still 7 seconds until... Yeah, he has to stop Brazy uh, for collecting uh, any armor. Yeah. And then his job is easy, especially with the orb. Oh, or just hit your rails. Well done for Maxter, it's looking good right now. This is exactly what I was talking about. Dude. The question is, is it too late for him? He's gonna rocket jump up. He knows he needs to do this with action. He cannot slack because as soon as he starts, you know, slacking, then Race is gonna find his, his um, you know, a stable uh, position to, to, to sit on again. He needs to constantly put pressure on Race if he is to even have a, just for the slightest chance in this game. Racy right now just com comfortably hopping around the map knowing that he doesn't have to do much other than stay alive but that's the third fight for Max. Or shut up. You can see Racy delaying the spawn as much yeah. as he can but Max <laughs> will predict it. Well I think Maxer actually can could have denied both lights in this corner. He's now taking the lower. Is he also getting the upper? No he needs to go to the heavy. He's gonna go to the heavy. Racy's very low. Uh, Max is gonna find another frag here, I'm sure. Because Racy's got nothing to pick up. Uh, both items picked up by Max. Here he comes swooping in. But Racy's. Well, quick speedy champion. He does have the inject. Yeah, the inject is ready. So that's always a pocket mega for Racy. That's a, a life blast. Racy's low. Pops the inject. 60 HP left. Max just gonna swoop in like a hawk here. Hawk on! Yeah, exactly. <laughs> a black hawk. It's Racy, however, picking up the mega this time. 50 HP though. Max just constantly putting pressure on him. I'd be surprised if Max just does not find a frag here. Oh, he doesn't actually go for it. Yeah, but Racy also being elusive. Not giving that much leeway for Maxter to attack. He, yeah, he already used his orb. So he has to go the classic way, plus forward. Look at Race, he just can't catch a break. Yeah, the York. Yes. Are you even trying? It wasn't ex queen clean, but uh, there are some poverty items for him. Uh, some health bubbles. He is a bit early on this heavy. He's very, very early actually, and as a result, Racy comes in and punishes him. And now Racy's gonna completely turn the tables. He's gonna pick up the heavy. Uh, well, Mega goes to Baxter, thankfully. Here's another engagement. Whoever wins this here can actually dictate. Never mind, if Maxter wins this, there's still a high chance that the Racy is gonna win. But if Racy wins it, he almost never sees the deal. 12 HP. Yeah, I'm so surprised that uh, these players are so good at dodging fights on this map. I know <laughs> from the beginning it was just really hard to get away from any fight on this map. Uh, now they have it down to the to the great positioning. They know all the escape routes. <laughs> okay, that's the game. But Max is gonna continue fighting here. Make the best out of the situation. Don't give up. You can always learn something anyway. But yeah, Racy sealed this. I'm sure. Another nice rail, engine comes out, Point shotgun blank. to finish it off. 12 to 4. It's a confident first map for Racy, which now puts him on a 2-0 advantage here in the in the grand finals.
make it 13 to 4 as Racy finds another frag. Here comes Maxter, maybe he's able to find a finishing frag here just to put some salt in the No, he doesn't. Almost, yeah. But that's it, 13 to 4. And you know, you look at the scoreline and you see 13 to 4, but you know, quite honestly, Maxter was giving him a, a run for his money the majority of that map. Uh, it was not easy for Racy. And for a long time, Racy was actually being hunted. Uh, we can see Maxter was the one controlling, but it was a bit too late in the game. I feel like he just couldn't really. Yeah, it was too late. Racy, Racy was already up to like 10, uh, 10 kills at that point. And at that time, it's just very, very hard to come back. Even if you have all the items and everything. Uh, Racy bought a lot of time just by, you know, jumping uh, around corners using the inject. You know, buying as much time as possible. That was the only thing he was trying to do. Yeah, um, we move on to the next map. Corrupted Keep. Maxer playing Stalker Peter, Razy playing Lena. Uh, yeah, Razy now on Tourney Point. So Maxer has, has to win this uh, for us to get another map. And I think he has the champion to do so. Yeah. No rail on this map. So the Peter is. Very frustrating to deal with. Switch to Maxter. There we go. Yeah. Okay, do or die for Maxter. Racy already up 2 0 coming from the upper bracket, having that one uh, map advantage. So Maxter needs to win the remaining three maps now. Can he do it? This would be the first map that he does it on. Finds the first track. It's a good start. Question is can he follow up? Here comes Racy flying in again, trying to equalize, trying to nullify that kill, but Maxter says no. Is he be able to finish a third one? Okay. Yes, he does. Looking good, Rob. Looking good so far. Yeah, and uh, we're also working with control. Destroy and uh, also means a lot. Yeah, it's just a, a, such a nice champion. You have the speed, you can. Pick up the story after the messy fight. And Galena only has the totems. Stop watch. Max start yeah, taking the breather before going for the portal. <laughs> He knows this is where this is where it matters. You gotta stay on point. Indeed. Oh, the wow. peaker. Full of connection. Oh, crazy. Oh, walks right into the rocket though, and Maxter doesn't even seem to flinch. That rocket was so natural. And here he is on the low grounds actually. He's trying to. He's gonna contest for this mega hit crazy. The double back. <laughs> Unexpected. And. Yeah. Yeah, certainly for Maxter. He falls uh, just before the mega half spells. So now, Crazy can get, attack this heavy with uh, enough sack to win the fight. That Maxter just lost all of his advantage here. 
That's the third frag in like 30 seconds. All of a sudden it's 3 to 4. Might be able to find fourth one because Max is still around. He's trying to to pressure this. What he doesn't know is that it's it's just so insane how fast Racy turns a match around. Like he gets yeah. one frag and then he can put so much pressure on every spawn that he just uh, ties it up again. But uh, this time yeah. around, Maxter's LG is better than Racy's. Yeah, thank God, because Racy was solo after that uh, previous engagement, and Maxter has now found two. So, yeah, good job from him. Uh, but yeah, exactly as you say, you don't want to give Racy even one kill because that's when he starts rolling. That's when the the train starts. Uh, you know, the only moving forward on the uh, five to six. Well, still well, early. I didn't expect this this map to be so filled with action, but this is really where it matters. Racy wants to win this three sir, wants to dictate, wants to show what he's capable of. But of course, Maxter wants to save his skin uh, and also uh, perform the potential reverse sweep to take the whole series. So both players are looking at at the you know finding control and they want to find it fast yeah he just sorry picked up the heavy so he knows that maxter will uh, want to play for those lights but he's being uh, a silent ninja <laughs> And he's trying to mount an attack on this heavy. Losing us out on the position. Activates the speaker. Wow, great damage actually. And he can still grab the light in the red room before the next fight. So yeah, he's doing great work of stripping the some of the overstack uh, races work. But now, didn't he have lightning gunners? I don't know. I, I, I think he could have won that fight if he used LG. Oh, uh, he's uh, trying to experiment. <laughs> it's not working out. No, certainly not. And Racy took that last frag. Now it's 6-6. Six to six and About to get his 7th because Maxter is very low. He's going to try to pressure the Mega, but he doesn't. So he basically st was sticking around there for no reason at all. Uh, 72 HP, no armor. Race is controlling everything right now. He can be. Uh, Max can pick up a, a light over here, I think. But that's about what he's going to be able to get. No, no light of still. Look at the stack Race is working with here. Around the corner he comes with the SMG. Okay. I didn't expect him to be there with the SMG. But maybe he knows that Max is there. Yep. Speaker deployed, but uh, Racy is on the hunt for the Peeper Peeper in public. Oh, Maxter is doing uh, great damage. And the Mega Health is uh, far away from spawning. Stop watch. Max are back in the lead. Oh, he had a great HMG, but then thinks the fight is over. But uh, Razy has his own plan. Wow. Razy uh, earns himself the heavy. But there is still some armor on the Maxter. This time around, he's getting the opening damage. Nice. Brilliant job from Maxter. He knows that Racy doesn't have a oh. high caliber weapon at that point. So he goes out with the peeker uh, just to bait out shots, bait out attention. And then he comes in and he gets it pretty confidently. And that's his ninth frag on the board. And 9-6, that gap between... Racy and Maxter is now is getting bigger and bigger and Racy he must start sweating now. He knows he needs to do something very quick. Now 
otherwise Max is gonna run away with this map. It's the way that he's playing right now, he's 100% controlling. He doesn't show any signs of fear or overthinking. He just, yeah, overall plays very, very nicely. Oh, but the totem. Oh yeah, the totem fortress. Yeah, I don't think it was the overstack, but just the small extra health boost from one totem was enough uh, that Tracy survived that fight at the heavy, and now he also gets the mega health. Yeah, Maxer not in control for well, about 90 seconds. He, he, he did postpone frag from Racy uh, for quite some time. Yeah, 90 seconds, but we'll make that one frag now. It's not a big gap anymore because you know, the momentum is still there. It's gonna dictate now what happens basically. What happens with the with the uh, yeah the major items here, because whoever wins this engagement here is gonna be able to pick out the mega, and it's gonna be a big help. The heavy is not up for another 15 seconds. Mega is gonna go to Racy. Okay, so good opportunity now for Racy to find his ninth frag, which would. Take this game to overtime. No, Maxter, out in the open. Yeah, but beautiful uh, use of the peak very well. Is it enough though? He's got 42 HP, he's got not, no health to pick yeah, up. There's... Oh, the two health bubbles are there. No yeah, armor on Maxter. If, if he gets into an LG fight, he will certainly fall. He does have the speed, so. Oh. Now he's caught up at the jump pad, yeah. Oh, My powers make me oh and the spawn force. Oh, but Racy doesn't trust his instinct. He was scared that uh, Maxer spawned near the heavy and would lose out on that item. Still, he gets a better hand of the damage. Sudden death. Oh, here comes Racy coming in. Oh, this could, this could settle everything. Oh, he misses the opportunity. He gets hit by the rail. And this frag here, this is where it all can happen. Oh. He has some G damage. What? <laughs> so much damage oh, from the H and G from Racy. Oh, they're both screaming. They're both low, but especially Maxter here. Thirty seconds have now passed. Some damage being dished out. Maxter is so low. He needs to get out of here. Slides away. He manages to survive. The question is... Oh, look at the difference in health here. If Razer doesn't run, come, run away with this, I don't know what's gonna happen. If Maxter... You know, Racy He needs to go in. He's got full control. Look at the stack! Yeah, he's a healthy girl. Oh, oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, but he's still playing it conservatively. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. not but really going all out. He's just working with control, trying to squeeze out Maxter. Yeah. So that he gives the frag up instead of uh, crazy, really taking it to an all in fight. Because he, yeah. he, he has the stack to do so, but yeah, if, if you. Get one unlucky bounce, then it goes Maxer's way. So exactly. he, he wants the f a guaranteed frag. Yeah. It's it can be dangerous to to hunt too much because uh, you know Maxer's bit of great resilience when it comes to the situations, hitting beautiful that. rockets and pretty pretty much nullifying the the uh, advantage that you would have going into that situation. So. But like again, Racy's controlling the uh, the items. Maxter just can't get him. Uh, and uh, but Maxter's actually been able to come up to a more healthy stack again, thanks to you know surviving the incoming sweep for Racy. But 2:20 now passed on the clock. Still, it, 
it's so gnarly from both of them here. Racy is constantly he's trying to find an opening here. Maybe this is it. Here comes the LG. Maxter. Nice. There we go. You win. GG's. Clean sweep for Racy. Yeah, 3 0 for Racy. Who, uh, who wins the entire uh, F Dual Cup, the third edition. And uh, yeah, coming in from the upper bracket with the with the uh, one map advantage. That was that was clean. Uh, I think Maxter really put up a fight, but yeah, uh, you could see the the difference in how they utilized, you know, what they had right there. Uh, just uh, yeah, but uh, was yeah, was very nice to watch. Indeed.